the court adjudicates you guilty of counts two, four, and 10, fraudulent use of personal information of the deceased over $100,000. James Fallman pleaded guilty to four counts of identity theft in a Hillsborough County courtroom in a property fraud scheme. He was charged with falsifying the deeds of four people to gain control of their homes. This typically happens when there's a death and property is left to another individual. It also happens with property that's vacant. Um, and so we have situations in which um, property is changes hands quickly and easily um, because the documents that the state requires are not um, as secure as we would like them. Fallman faced up to 30 years for each count, but through a plea deal, he'll only have to serve 10 years. Property fraud is one of the fastest growing white collar crimes in Florida. Cindy Stewart, the Hillsborough County Clerk of Court and Comptroller, offers a free service where you'll be notified if someone changes a recorded document, a deed or mortgage in your name. The clerk's office offers this service because we're the last stop in recording. Um, so when, uh, when someone comes to um, the counter to record a deed or change a mortgage or do any kind of transaction around a piece of property, we're the last stop for that filing. So it's easy for us to recognize some of the red flags that might be happening. Um, and it's easier for us to notify you if those, if those things are, should not be changing on your property. To sign up, just go to our website on your screen or use the QR code.